Instagram pic. <laughs> we went to the Japanese market again today and we got the my favorite green tea cookies. I remember I showed you guys this before. If you guys ever see this at your Asian markets, pick it up because it's the best thing ever. And then we also got some more of the green tea soba noodles and then the sauce that goes with it and also this new, well new to us, it's the matcha chocolate pocky. I've never tried it before so pick that up as well. And I also picked up a extra bag of soba noodles and a sauce for my mom and that's pretty much what I'm going to give her for Mother's Day. Super simple because she watched our she watches our vlogs. Hi mom! <laughs> so um, she called me one day and she's like, where did you guys like get the soba noodles? Because she it looked very tasty to her and she never tried, had it before. So I thought I might as well get, get it for her for Mother's Day since it's hard to get her stuff for Mother's Day and I would think she would really appreciate food because she loves food just like me. So that's what I'm going to give her and then I'll probably I asked her what she wanted to do for Mother's Day and then she was like, oh, I'm just, we just, or she just wants to cook at home and then have everybody over. So I'm like, okay, I'll just come over and help her early in the morning because, you know, Mother's Day, she, you need to relax a little bit. <laughs> but she's the type to like do stuff and go, go, go. So that's pretty much what I'm going to do. Just go help her, be a good daddy, and then give her some of the soba noodles. So hopefully she enjoys that as well. But yeah, we just got home and Alan, what are you doing, babe? Making cookies. Oh yeah, Alan's making more green tea cookies. I'm like green tea overload. Like, I love green tea, but I think I'm gonna like explode of green tea soon. <laughs> yeah, right, she always said that, but she loves it. Yeah, but I'm so full, because we just, <laughs> it's so funny, we just, I just finished drinking a green tea frappuccino. <laughs> Seriously, I think my skin's gonna turn green soon. <laughs> but yeah. So yummy! So I've been searching on my phone of what my mom is actually wanting to make for Mother's Day tomorrow. And I've never had this in my entire life. Like even though I'm Vietnamese, I've never tried it ever. Which is so weird because I've tried it before. Yeah. <laughs> this is all new to me. But Oops. yeah, clearly my mom didn't make it for us when we were children. But it's basically called bun cock. I know, bun cock. <laughs> <laughs> The second part doesn't sound very nice, but it's kind of like a, what I'm reading here. It is a yellow little crispy cakes. It's kind of like a little pancake or something. And it has crispy school prawns and fried shallots in it. And basically you wrap it with lettuce and all the herbs and everything, cucumbers, and then dip it in fish sauce. So that sounds pretty yummy. That's what it looks like there kind of like little pancakes and then you just wrap it all up with Vietnamese herb and of course can't forget the fish sauce so yeah I'm excited kind of cool too hopefully if it's good babe I can make it for you at home maybe you can bring it home for me I'll make it for you maybe you can just bring it home for me I'll make it for you <laughs> no she can bring it home for me <laughs> <laughs> so mean <laughs> time to put our wedding pictures in the frames finally got the right picture well what's it called the right position picture printed <laughs> out <laughs> so I'm ex super excited to see what it's gonna look like the final product but I do really like how Costco has their black and white it did turn out really nice even though I didn't like edit it or anything and just straight up from color to black and white is really nice and so cheap too yeah, it's only 99 cents. Mm -hmm. You guys ready to see the final result? It turned out really pretty. What do you guys think? Really nice. I think it's going to look really pretty and soft in our bedroom. What do you guys think? I love it so much. What do you think, babe? Do you like it? Do you like it? Yeah. Did you see this one already? Yep. Yeah. So cool. Clearly we like kissing each other. <laughs> <laughs> Both fingers just kissing. I know, but it's so cool. It turned out really nice. And of course this, my fail one, will go, I guess, in the living room or we'll see where this one goes. But so pretty. I love the outcome. For dinner tonight we're making green curry and it's not something I know how to make from scratch. So we kind of make it instant, but I kind of 
um, add a few things into it to make it a little bit better. So maybe we'll show you guys and see how you guys like it. All you need is some chicken. This was chicken drumstick meat. I deboned it and cut them into little pieces. Some onion, some brown sh oh, let me open it. Brown sugar. I have green curry paste. A can of instant green curry. Some fish sauce and a bunch of bamboo shoots. First, brown the onions. And then once the onion is brown, you brown the chicken. Uh, if it comes out of the bowl. There we go. Ah! And then once the chicken's been slightly browned, I put in a roughly a spoon of the green curry paste. A bunch of fish sauce. Oops. Okay, that was a little bit too much. And roughly three spoonfuls of, well, I, I like to use brown sugar. So if you guys don't have brown sugar, white sugar would work too. And I know I'm putting in a lot of sugar in because curry paste is really spicy. We bought the more mild one this time, but it was still a little bit spicier than well, what me and Linda can handle and the sugar kind of offsets that spiciness so when we're actually ready to eat it, it's actually quite nice. And after you guys have stirred that all together, cooked it up for about two or three minutes, in goes the rest of the ingredients. The can of instant curry. And then all the bamboo shoots. I used canned bamboo shoots. There was... Two cans of Aroid D bamboo shoots that I put into here. I rinsed it all out, soaked it for about half an hour to soak out all the extra salt. And here it goes. Yummy. Ooh. Ooh, can you okay. stir all pull pull that? After all of that, after you pull the ingredients in, basically just cook it up for another 10, 15 minutes or so and it's ready to eat. This is my favorite part of the green curry. I love the bamboo shoots because they're so crunchy and everything. Mm. And are you guys happy? Alan's actually vlogging for you guys. Chef Alan's back! <laughs> Cooking instant curry. <laughs> <laughs> so the curry's all cooked now and we're about to pull it all out so we can dig in. Mm. And during that 10-15 minutes that we were waiting for it to cook out, I washed all the dishes! <laughs> It's a smart thing that we do so that when we're done eating, we don't have that big, humongous mess to clean up. So usually what we do is, when our food is cooking, we'll, we'll go to the sink, wash a couple <laughs> dishes, go check on our food, go to the sink, wash a couple dishes, go check on our food. So then hopefully that by the time we're all done, it's there's no more dishes except for what we have left. Mm -hmm. so here. Oh, too much saliva. <laughs> <laughs> you just ate like a glob of ice cream. Yeah. But here's the finished dish! Green curry with lots and lots of bamboo shoots. Good job, Chef Alan. Oh, look how cute this is. A little pug paddle boarding with his owner. <laughs> That's so adorable. This is in Vancouver. Along, I don't know where it is. False Creek. There you go. So cute. Makes me miss Beans so much. Can't wait to see him later today. <laughs> Happy Mother's Day to all the moms out there! You guys are awesome and we love you! So today is a very beautiful, gorgeous, warm, sunny day in Vancouver for Mother's Day! <laughs> so right now I am headed to the Vietnamese market because my mom of course called me in the morning and said she's missing some sugar to make the fish sauce. So I'm gonna go ahead and go there and get some fish, oh no, get some sugar for her. And then, yeah, head over to my mom's house and then, yeah, celebrate with her for Mother's Day and help her make that Vietnamese dish called Ban Khat. So that will be fun. And then, yeah, missing Alan right now because he has work so he can't come with me. And it's so funny, we're like joking around with each other and I said, Oh, um, mom's gonna really miss her favorite son-in-law. <laughs> and he's like, I'm her only son-in-law. <laughs> Got it. Got my mom's goods in here. This is what we're eating. It's like little kind of pancakes. Mm -hmm. And it has 
like beans and then shrimp and also green onion and then after these get golden brown my mom puts coconut um what is that coconut milk coconut meal on top of it and then it's ready to eat okay so after our mother's day lunch at home we're pampering my mom a little bit my sister kim is doing her makeup while i give her a good rub-a-dub <laughs> back yeah. massage and sadie what are you doing over there come on Me. this is my mom's before <laughs> Doesn't my mom look beautiful for her mommy makeover? This is her after. Very natural. How do you feel, mom? No cry. Good. <laughs> you didn't even press it yet. <laughs> so home now and my mom was so sweet to pack up um, some of the stuff we ate for Alan so when he got off work he can have some dinner isn't she sweet baby <laughs> thanks mom but um, I haven't I didn't show you guys how to actually eat it so Alan's gonna show you and I'm not gonna film his face or anything because he looking he looks very tired and oily and gross right now <laughs> so he's not gonna be on camera so I'll show him uh, I'll show you guys his hands. So basically, you rip off a piece of lettuce. Mm -hmm. You put the thing in. It's called bun cock. Okay, bun cock. <laughs> and then you put in a cucumber. And there's also all these different herbs. herbs. What is it called? I know this is mint. And there's also this thing. I, I don't like that thing. It's very fragrant and aroma. Yeah. And then just wrap it. Well, usually you need a bigger piece of lettuce. Mm -hmm. So you just wrap it up, dip, dip it, in it in the sauce. And then you eat it. Oh, yum. Do you guys want some too? Open wide. Do you want some sauce? Here you go. Open wide. It's coming. Um.